That will work. <laughs> what is this monstrosity? Please tell us. Okay, so code name Bastard Bow. This is a bow that I did not have draw mods for, and I've had it for many years. One of my first bows. You can barely see it over the rattle can spray paint job that I did on it. It's a Matthews Mission. Um, but I had a bunch of spare parts because I sold one of my other, like obviously higher quality bows. So I put the tight spot on here, put the spot hog, Tommy hog, and then I ran an ultra view scope um, on there as well with a target sight or with a target pin. And then I've got the telescoping, telescope, what is that? Telescoping, telescoptic. Teles um, telescoping. Scoping. There yeah. we go. Telescoping stabil or stabilizer on there. And then I've got my uh, rattle can set up here. Um, but yeah, it's just a, just kind of a mess around bow that I thought I'd bring up here so I didn't have to bring my other bow because I didn't really want to mess with it. So, But I didn't have draw mods, so I had to put an extra inch of draw on here because I didn't have... <laughs> enough draw length and it actually settles in pretty good with the string angle and everything so <laughs> there we go it's a little loud but these arrows are not in there super tight we're gonna see if we can kill coyote with it though I did forget freaking some broadheads so I'm gonna have to just plunk him with a field point. There we go. It is drifting a little bit, but not as much as I thought it would. Because I tried to overcompensate for the one that was on the impacted right, and I it hit right where it went off. And these ones are like a half inch or an inch left. There we go. <laughs> Just get, get old set up. Yeah, dude, you can shoot this all you want. Like I said, it's just a oh, fart around bow. Mess around bow anyway. So. That's my draw length. Yep. With the D loop like that. <laughs> <laughs> And then I tried to overcompensate, and then those ones I just held barely here. We'll take those. 44 yards. Oh yeah, and I run like stainless steel collars and stuff on the arrows. <laughs> Versus like everybody else uses like glue in points. There's a few guys that don't like it at all. They're like all old school, like, <laughs> oh, why would you shoot that? Like, blah, blah. You're, you're trying to be accurate. But like I said, I've only got like a couple handicap. <laughs> They've got like 11 or 12 on their handicap. Well, that just makes it that more embarrassing when you smoke that's, them. I know, that's what I'm saying. So without the handicap, um, I think I'm sitting in like third place. <laughs> And the only two guys that are above me are actually, they're super, super good. They're actual competitive archers that go like all around the country and stuff, but they're locals. Here, I'll put these in here and you can, you can shoot it all you want. Oh yeah. You can come up here if you want. I know, dude, he had fun. For real, that's it. Yeah, I did. No. 
Huh? Like right here, just so we don't. I don't know yet. I'm gonna oh, put a couple. Says you got? Oh, you have that. I didn't know you had one of those. Huh? What? That? Doesn't that range up for you? No. Oh. I have one at home, but. You know how many times have we been hunting? We've been right here at camp and I watched a big bull walk right by camp where everybody's up top. Yeah. Well that's why I was that's why I was hoping like my first day here, I was glassing over there. I'd hope I was hoping I'd find one. It's just like just have him stay, huh? Yeah. Just camp on him. Alright, I don't know if this side tape's even accurate, so I'm just gonna aim for a middle <laughs> middle bag right now. And then I gave it some extra clicks on. Oh nope, that ain't gonna work. Damn it. Uh the site housing doesn't clear. What do you mean? Mm. We'll try it actually. No, don't stick it into someone's truck. No, I know. I'm gonna move up to <laughs> eight. I'm gonna move to 85 just to see if it'll clear before we do anything. I'm actually glad you moved up because right behind you was the prickly pear. Oh. I was having PTSD flashbacks. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Now we should be good. So 83. It's a bastard. Ah, hit the bag. I think I almost hit the black. Yeah, you almost did. You're dang close to it. That arrow is freaking whipping around as it when yeah. it goes off. That one hit. Dude, that thing is l just lobbing in there. <laughs> yeah. It's just literally just putting it in a direction and doing the same thing every time. It doesn't matter if it's straight or not. This wind is kicking these arrows so hard with these veins. I was having the same issue. Yeah, that's kind of yeah. weird. They've just never ever done that before. I also haven't cleaned this one at all. I need to spray it with some bullet brake cleaner and then put a drop of oil on it. <laughs> With a freaking 50 feet per second bow. <laughs> They're right it'd have enough time it'd have enough time to get from here to the other side of the road before the arrow gets there. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All the way over camp. Doug would be mad if he probably if he saw this. <laughs> He probably would. Yeah. Going Doug, huh? For the limited amount of time. 
At least he took the dogs with him so that they're not yeah. chasing after it. It's it's there, the RV. Yeah. It's the it's I think it's the fridge to be honest with you. Oh, okay, that makes more sense. Good. Yeah, I just landed on the biggest pad in my body. <laughs> my ass. It's the only thing that I haven't fallen on. Yeah. Fallen on my knee. Fallen on my hand. Rolled your ankle yet? I have not. Thank God. For real, I'm oh. actually very surprised. I saw you almost roll your ankle like four times this morning, but yeah, these boots are longer than I'm used to, dude. I literally like catch them. I think oh, the end of my toes, like there. Huh? These are way nicer than the other ones. Yeah. Yeah. Mammoths. I think that's what they're called. Mammoths, maybe. It's M A M M U T. Two that felt the best are like touching. Yeah. I should have just kept holding it. No, yeah, hopefully we find a dead elk head up or head down. Not bad for 83. Would have had lungs. Ah, almost all lungs, except for those two idiots. Come on! Jesus. Oh my bad. Fuck it, just like the prickly pear. Oh. Now you're gonna have bow PTSD. 